Hi, everybody. Good afternoon. Happy Friday. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with our midseason, our eight box midseason football mixer. Pick your team number two, version two. Big thanks to these folks getting into the action right here on a Friday. Mike Thomas with the uh, last bond mojo. I guess we are pretty much at the middle of the season, huh? It's gone by fast. Not even week seven this week. All right. Let's get these set up here. Um, so eight boxes. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Um, where should we start? Should we start from the past? What's the oldest thing here? 2012 Momentum Football is the oldest thing here. So let's go back to the past and then back to the future. So this is 2012 Momentum Football. 2012 is Andrew Luck, Russell Wilson? Yeah. Okay, Andrew Luck, Russell Wilson, and among others, I'm sure. RG3. RG3, that's right. Do people still like the RG3? Brandon Whedon. Brandon Whedon in 2012. Derek Anderson, maybe? I don't think Derek Anderson is probably before 2012. Case Keenum, 2012? Might be. Might be. Might be. All right. Well, good luck, everybody. Oh, Tice is saying, Tice is saying, start with the Russell Wilson rookie auto. Uh, Bobby Wagner as well. Tice is saying. All right, so a box of 2012 Momentum Football. Let's adjust this microphone here a little bit. All right. Good luck. Our first relic is Preferred Picks, Jarius Wright. 81 out of 99 for the Vikings. Conrad. Conrad, do you remember? You're a Vikings. Do you remember Jarius Wright? Is he on the Panthers now? That's what Nick Jaspi is saying in the background. We've got rookie team threads for the Cleveland Browns. There's Brandon Whedon, dual relic. 135 out of 199, one of the many dozens of quarterbacks they've had over the years. And that will go to Richard L. and the Cleveland Browns. I think they found the one, though, in Baker Mayfield, finally. Double feature, Eli Manning and... Hakeem Nix, double feature materials, 38 out of 149. 2012 was probably back when the Giants were pretty good, right? 2012. Now Eli Manning's like a shell of himself. Bring on the Kyle Laletta era. Speaking of the Giants, triple relic and autograph, David Wilson. Wasn't David Wilson that had the bad neck injury? And couldn't play anymore? Was Wilson, yeah. I think David Wilson. Like he was gonna be he was looking like a good running back, and then he had like a serious neck injury, I'm pretty sure, and then had to retire. This printing plate has been hiding in here since 2012. It's Josh Freeman. He was kind of decent. Chris Parent with the Buccaneers. All aboard the Big Head Express. Woo woo! We got Jason Pierre Paul with all his fingers in this shot. This is yeah. This is pre pre fireworks incident. Seven out of twenty five. That's another one for the Giants. Dennis Aquino with that one. All right, and you know what? I, I did hear about that earlier today. Andrew K. reminding us, hey, did everyone see that? Carlos Hyde got traded to the Jaguars for a future fifth-round pick. Nick, are we taking the Jacksonville Jaguars now? 
Minus five. Okay, we're not. Dwight Bentley, Detroit Lions. I don't think we're going to. Is he even going to play? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Where's Jamal Charles? Are they just going <laughs> to? I don't know. Yeah, where has Fournette been? All right, that goes to the Lions. That'll be for Aaron. We've got another relic here. There's Kendall Wright. Tennessee Titans jumbo relic. That'll be for DVD. Good to see you, Dustin. DVD in on the action. Out of 99. We got Raymond Berry. Raymond Berry relic. And uh, I don't even remember this guy. Levante David? Does he? Uh, out of 799. That's a lot of stickers for Levante David. That's another one for the Buccaneers. That'll be for Chris Parent. There you go. Blast from the past. Yes, Nick Chubb starting is good for the hobby, John Tamlinson. He's still, he's still in Tampa? Why do I not remember this guy? Uh, there's, there's, there's too many. I'm, I'm poor with defensive guys. All right. And for the Colts, Raymond Berry. I know Raymond Berry, though. Colts, Richard L. All right, so that was 2012. 2012. So now the next year that we can go into is 2014 Panini Select Football. So that has who? Who is the? Who are the big rookies in 2014? There's. Oh right. Wow. That's that's a great year. Now, remember how much Bortles was selling for back then? 2014? This was actually our... Uh, <laughs> and Derek Carr, too. This was uh, probably one of the first... One of the first breaks that, uh, that, we, that I did back in the day, 2014. Oh, Khalil Mack? Mike Evans? And Aaron Donald? All right, so this is a great year. All right, what are we... We're looking for... Doesn't say how many we're gonna find in here. We're gonna find things in here. Look for. Jeez. That's pretty good. All right. Well, good luck, everybody. We're we're in the year 2014. So we started with 2012. We're moving two years forward. See what we got. Oh, sorry. Change that. All right. Good luck, everybody. The year 2014. One ninety nine points. Is that the first year they did points? At a ninety nine, Alshon Jeffrey, Jeff Jeff Matthews, Colts edition to ninety nine. We'll sleeve and top load all those before they go out. This is winner take all on the points. So if there's any other points that come out, we'll put them into one pile, give it to one person. Telvin Smith is your first autograph. Thirty one out of fifty for the Jag URs. It goes to Lee and the Jags. Was that that long ago? John Samuels was saying, back in 2014, Ellen DeGeneres took an epic celeb-filled selfie during the Oscars. The selfie also set the record for the most retweeted of all time. Until that guy won free nuggets last year. Oh, yeah. Mm, free nuggets. Uh, man, was that that long ago? That Matt like Hazel. years ago that happened. I don't know why. There's Odell Beckham Jr., rookie. Odell Beckham Jr., rookie relic out of 149. Not a fan of water. Not a fan of water, apparently. Not a fan of Eli Manning, either. Dennis Aquino with the Giants. And 
Oh, and he sold us. Then there's Eli Manning. And then Coney Ely. Nice. Oh, he's a rookie then too. Rookie auto, Coney Ely for the Panthers. That'll be for Anthony. All right, and then Elway and Chris Johnson in the back there. All right, that was 2004. Now it's going to 2016 Phoenix football. 2016 Phoenix football. We did some 2018 recently. So thanks to everybody who had gone to those breaks. We may get another little bit of that in the future. Keep an eye out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. There's always football on the site, so check it out. Oh, I definitely remember that. Solange and Jay-Z had a shocking fight on an elevator after an event at the Met Gala. Man, that was... That was the, the, the smack heard around the world. And Ray Rice was the elevator same year, I think. So there were, what, the, 2014 was the year of the elevator? Maybe he was 2015. Um, maybe the next year. I think... Um, if, you like, uh, if you like kind of like neo-soul, ladies and gentlemen... Solange has a good uh, has a, has some good uh, some good music. Uh, no, yeah, well, because I think Solange had found out that Jay Z was cheating on Beyonce, and yeah, that's and Solange, huge shocker. yeah, huge shocker, right? And uh, and then Solange flipped out. You can't do that to my sister, kind of thing. And and then and then fighting ensued. Right, yeah, and then well, no, and then Beyonce released Lemonade, and then. And then Jay-Z had his, like, apology record, and they went on tour together, made hundreds of millions of dollars. <laughs> yeah, it probably is a, is a stunt. All right. Now that we're breaking it down. I know, right? Now that it seems like, oh, that's yeah. kind of clever. And then a world tour. Because yeah. remember, they, they were touring yeah. together, and everyone's like, oh, my God, Jay-Z and Beyonce are, yeah. are going to get divorced and the power couple and rigged. Here's 2016 Phoenix. 2016 Phoenix was not rigged. Ladies and, and gentlemen. Decide, oh, I better go see Bay, Beyonce and Jay-Z. Yeah, got to gotta go see Bay and Z. And, no, but then they're like, oh. Hove and B are still together. Jersey Auto, Kenyon Drake. Biggest song of, think this is John Tamison. This is great. Biggest song of 2016, Closer or Closer by Chainsmokers. <laughs> Not a big chain smokers fan. People people love him though. There's Jared Goff. Triple relic. Out of twenty five. There that's rookie Jared Goff, right? That's rookie yeah, it's two thousand sixteen. That goes to the Rams, Philip with the Rams. Kenyon Drake, by the way, goes to Randy and the Dolphins. I like looking at these old products, even though this is only a couple years older. But you can see how far Phoenix, because we just recently did 2018 Phoenix, just in two years. I like new Phoenix a lot better than 16 Phoenix, you know what I mean? You can already see some of the differences. All right. Redemption time. It's Alex Collins. Hot Rookie Material Signatures Helmet Logo. That's pretty cool. Alex Collins uh, going to Tice and the Seattle Seahawks. 2016. Is it expired? It just recently expired. But Panini is pretty good about honoring those redemptions so you can or at least giving you something else in return i'm sure they'll be happy to send you some alex collins there you go tice kurt warner 25 and devonta poor devonta freeman on the back there all right that's it 2016 also best picture la 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 i mean moonlight Remember when that happened? That was crazy. That was 2016. That was 2016. I didn't realize that was that long ago. I it was 
but they were like, they were like, you know, La La Land, and then everybody went up, and they're like, no, this is not a joke. We made a mistake. Uh, 2006, we're staying in 2016 with Infinity Football. 2016 Infinity Football. To Infinity and Beyond. Are they making another Toy Story? Yeah, Man. I, I, I actually would say, you know how you... I was going to say, you know how most sequels are kind of terrible? Toy Story 3 is the second one. Most sequels are always terrible, but the Toy Stories franchise has been pretty fantastic. I like Toy Story. I didn't like 2. Well, they're all, yeah, 2 was not in. 2 was okay. I mean, it was good, but it, it was... when they're all by the fire. But it was... Like, well, was spoiler just, alert. I mean... 2009. Two, that's true. <laughs> that's like the Shawshank. That's true. Or Usual Suspects. A.J. Green. Yeah. LaShawn McCoy. If I didn't say they're going to die. To 88. Die, so. Oh, more Alex Collins for Tice. Tice is like something else, please. Sorry, Tice. You're going to get more Alex Collins. Isn't he doing okay in Baltimore? Baltimore? They should have. I accidentally called him Baltimore on a redemption. For more stuff. I forgot he played for Seattle for like a day. There's Tyler Boyd to 288. Good old Tyler Boyd for the Bengals. Richard with the Bengals. And Laquan Treadwell. It's all right. Look at that. 253 out of 288. I love this. Right on the uh, a piece of metal right there. Yeah, I do like that. They're going to do a lot more of that, folks. I think in, in a lot of products, you're going to start seeing a lot more of that. You already We're already seeing a lot more of that. It's kind of a way to get around stickers. So they just sign a stack of metal pieces instead. Ah, 2016, President Donald Trump was elected. With no help from any Russians. All right. So there you go. Uh, Conrad with the Vikings. And uh, we're moving on to 2017. 2017 Prestige Football. John Oakray, big Brewers fan, saying, tell you what, Joe, give the Brewers the game tonight and we'll settle things in Game 7. Everyone loves a Game 7. Everyone but but my heart. I think my doctor said, can't watch baseball anymore during the playoffs. 2016 Callum Winslow Jr. not behind bars yet. Was it 2014 when... Uh Skipped over that. Remember how Aaron Hernandez murdered people? But then, did you see the news story about what he's that he's not murdering he's people? No, oh. that's dark. Before. I mean, that's no excuse to start murdering people, no, though. Know. Tom Savage, Cody Kessler. Definitely not. And we got a Dory Jackson in the middle right there for the Titans. Oh, yeah, I remember the configuration. on Some of these can be autographed, too. I kind of like these passports. Those don't count anymore. All right. So the Dory Jackson goes to DVD and the Titans. Next pack. Is that right? Four consecutive NLCS. I mean, I mean, who is who's really keeping track of that? It's like the Eagles. <laughs> it's a bad, it's a bad return. <laughs> no World Series. No it's a bad return. But a, I'm an oh, nice, Corey Davis. Out of one fifty. Man, I'm still waiting for him to break out, Corey Davis. Like, he's on the cusp. DVD with the Corey Davis. I'm an Eagles fan, so I don't you've, know anything you've, about losing. You've, yeah, you've got yours taken good. care of. We're pretty clutch last year, so. All right, there's Vic Beasley Jr. And a couple more packs out of here. But I will say, it takes a little bit out of it once you win. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> a little bit out of it. Nick's jaded now. Nick's like Eagles won. I'm like, mm, we lost to the Titans. Big deal. You know. Speaking of the we Eagles, the there's Bowl. there's Wendell Smallwood. He's starting now. Dust off your Wendell Smallwoods, folks. And there's Artavis Scott to 150 for the Bolts. That'll be for Isaac with the Chargers. Eagles should have made a move for Carlos Hyde. Yeah, why didn't the Eagles go for Carlos Hyde? Maybe they're waiting on Le'Veon Bell? What if the Cowboys got Le'Veon Bell and just turned into a receiver? Slot receiver? That would be great. There's Brad Kaya, Lions edition out of 150. And we've got Malik McDowell. That's for Tice and the Seahawks. Gilo, what's going on? All right, just a few boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. We have, uh, we're going to stay in two, well, actually, we're going to do this last, just because it's nicer, the 2017 Vertex. We're going to skip ahead to 2018 really quick. So we'll do unparalleled first, two autographs and one memorabilia card per box on average for 2018 unparalleled football. Then we'll do 2018 XR, then we'll close out with 2017 Vertex. Take a little sip of tea there. All right. Good luck, everyone. Oh, Gilo says, just so everyone knows, after I win the lottery tonight, I'm buying out all the breaks. So buy your spots now on jazbeescasebreaks.com. See, the problem is, Gilo, I, I too picked up some Mega Millions tickets. So, hey, you should, you should do it soon. Well, I like to buy it at the last minute. They sell the winning tickets at the end. Oh, do they really? They, yeah. they, they, they sell the winning tickets at the end, yep. says Nick Chaspi. So he's going to wait until the last minute. I was buying out Fanatic's personal breaks. Oh, dang. 500 mil after tax. Yeah, it's, it's a lot of money. Government also gets 500 mil. Yeah, come on. Government. Josh Allen, rookie focus relic. That goes to Rick Hunt and the Bills. Anyone else get Mega Million tickets? No, it should be the Jaspers case. Oh man, some of these cards have numbers on the yeah. back. I There's John the Kelly, one. unparalleled. I kind of know which ones now. Autograph, that'll go to, come on, unparalleled. I'll go to the Rams, that'll be for Philip. And Mart bought a few. We should yeah, we should do a Jaspi spool. Next time it gets too close to a billion, we'll all split it. James Washington jersey and autograph for the Steelers. That'll be for Jess, Jess Fox and the Steelers. Oh, here are some numbered cards right here that we'll sleeve up, top load before they go out. I feel like that's number two, right? Nice Antonio Callaway to 25. Antonio Callaway showing some moments of, of excellence on the field. These guys as well. The out of 25s and under, I usually sleeve and top load right away. Oh, you'll buy the Hitless promo for uh, ten million dollars. Yeah, we'll just give you the Austin Matthews jersey at that point, Gilo. <laughs> we'll 
we'll be able to find some more after that for everybody else. All right. Now, what convenience store did you buy it at? 7-Eleven, right up on PCH. Do they do 7-Eleven? Has 7-Eleven been hot no, lately? I don't know. No, well, nobody, <laughs> no, nobody, uh, that 7-Eleven doesn't have like a, uh, like a $10,000 one here the, kind of thing. The Mickey's Deli has one that someone won $10 million. At Mickey's Deli? So See, you can't win there again. Yeah, but no, you can't win high. there again. High. What are the odds of someone winning millions of dollars at the same location? Then it's rigged. No, what if he has a sister at the lottery <laughs> at the, the, or something? 2018 XR football coming at you. That story about the this Josh Allen was number 75. So this will also go to you, Rick. That story about how the security guard kept wanting to... Oh, yeah. That was a... That was a documentary? Why do I know that? Was it a Netflix documentary? The, There's the James power. Washington, 24 out of 75, Triple Relic, from XR. That'll, that's another one for Jess. And the Steelers. TJ got 20 at the office. Figured, why not? Right. Well, see, I, I, was, telling, uh, I was telling someone earlier... You know what? I'm not greedy. I'll take the I'll take the three and the mega number and $2? win like fifty fifty thousand dollars something like that. Two dollars. Two bucks. I have exactly that. Oh, wow, that's a sign. Tyler Conklin for uh, Conrad and the Vikings. God's given me this money tonight. Wow. I don't think I had two dollars when I woke up today, and now I do. It's a sign. It's a sign that God wants you to put Is it. There like a saint put it on. Lottery? You know, like how the saint oh yeah, the the, the the patron saint yeah. of of you'd have to find like a patron saint of like good oh. luck or something like that. Yeah. I don't think there's one for like <laughs> for for gambling. <laughs> <laughs> and there's Philip Rivers out of ten. It's in the, the the new one, the new Bible coming out. The new Bible coming out. <laughs> All right. No, well, no one carries cash. The kids these days don't carry cash, T.J. I don't have a lot of cash. <laughs> we got Sony Michelle, 21 out of 49. Oh, man. I have a blank check and $2 in my insurance card. That's it. Sad times for Nick Jaspi. Sony Michelle. Know. Karen with her Patriots. And you do quick pick, right? Oh, yeah. I always quick pick. I can't rely on... Yeah, well, then you have to, because then you just have to pick the same GD numbers, like for the rest of your life. Because one day it's going to hit and you're going to be like, right. why didn't I pick my same GD numbers? Right. Yeah. It's like picking a player in fantasy and next week you have to. You, you kind of have to roll with it. What if he blows it's up? Like, it's like doubling your bet after a few losses in blackjack. You just kind of right, have to right. kind of. Because yeah. there's no way the dealer's going to get. <laughs> win the can next can win the next hand. Yeah. All right, so we're closing out, we're going back a year, closing out with 2017 Vertex. What? That's see, that's rigged, Andrew K. Andrew says there's a gas station by me that has that that have had two, three million dollars scratch scratch off winners. They run hot. I'm telling you, these stores run hot. So like that one roll of scratchers <laughs> has like, come on. I'm sure there's like a website that has all the all the winning locations, like mapped out like on Google Maps or something like that to get the data from like but I don't the lottery. Say if I win on air because then someone will come and, and murder us. us. Yeah, steal the ticket. Right, I would tell nobody. It'll just show Jaspies <laughs> offline. <laughs> <laughs> or adult people will know when I accidentally drop my Tesla keys on yeah. the on the in front of the camera. Oh, oops! Yeah, did you win that a lot? No, I just just the Tesla I've always had. Uh, that is Cooper Cup going to the Rams. That'll be for Philip and your cornerstones, or I guess they call them capstones. But I think they renamed it. Your quad relic yeah. and autograph is seventy-seven out of ninety-nine. Corey Davis, Titans DVD. I think they're gonna change it now because I think capstones made no sense. I think they're going to call them cornerstones from now on. Yeah, I'm not sure what that is. All right, next one. 
you watch this, uh, Gilo watched a documentary of this lady who kept buying out all the rolls of scratchers at a gas station and eventually hit the jackpot. I suppose you eventually would. How much, how much would a roll be? Probably the jackpot, whatever the jackpot is. That's how much it costs. <laughs> it's rigged. Nine out of ten, Golden Tate. So do the convenience stores get money on selling them? Yeah, you get a cut. Then how long does it take for the government to pay back the Seven Eleven that I just withdrew my cash from? I have that I have no like idea. Five hundred bucks I win, they have to pay out of their pocket. No, I don't think they do. That I, actually, I don't know. Yeah, I think it's at that a cer- like at a certain they amount. Hate, they hate when I come in and cash it. We've got Jake Butt. He's a tight end, and Malik McDowell. Another Malik McDowell for Tice and the Seahawks. Starting your Malik McDowell PC. Hi, Arthur. It's a used one, though. <laughs> it's like the first one. Battery never holds a charge. It's terrible. <laughs> Jake Butt, he's a tie. I don't really have a Tesla. Jake Butt for William. William Cho with that one. 30 out of 49, a cent autograph. And the last one out of the break. Tesla Roadster. Yeah, I got the old. The sports car one. The old Tesla Roadster. Doesn't hold a charge anymore. Oh, the Tesla big wheeler, 18 wheeler. There's a Tesla Solar 18 wheeler? Power coming Ooh. Out soon, I think. We're not quite there yet, Arthur. <laughs> not at, we're not at Tesla money yet. Derek Wolf, we've got to sell out more mixers, so that's going to happen. 88 out of 99. We have to, move from <laughs> we have to sell out opulence basketball. <laughs> There's Derek Wolf relic. For the Denver Broncos, William Cho. And DeMarco, where's DeMarco Murray these days? 23, you can, Eagles could get DeMarco Murray out of retirement. I hope not. That was so painful. <laughs> or they, already tried, they already tried that, huh? Yeah, they tried that. And tried that, did not work. Cool DeMarco Murray, though. I like the relics in there. Uh, that goes to, I think Cowboys never should have let him go. I think at yeah. the end of the day. That Anyhow. Uh, that's Marco Murray for the Titans DVD with the Titans. And that is it, folks. That's our eight box mixer. We got 150 points to give away. Those are just blank cards. So let's go to random.org. Let's get everyone's names on random.org. Those are teams. How about names? There we go. And we'll roll the dice. We'll randomize 12. Come on, random.org. It's just for 150 points. Come on, random.org. Four, and then the big five. Like two. Come on, come on. I know, yeah. And, and, the, and, the, and next time there's a big hit to randomize, it'll be like Snake Eyes. 10, 11, and 12th and final time. Name on top is Anthony. Anthony, 150 points coming your way. There you go, folks. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. That was our eight-box midseason football mixer. Thanks for getting in. It was a pretty solid break. Lots of fun. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.